Giselle's return at the end of Fast X may have surprised some fans, but the writers did sort of hint at her return eight years earlier thanks to one specific incident. Played by Gal Gadot, Giselle made her debut in The Fast and the Furious as an important member of the Braga cartel. However, her allegiances changed to the Toretto O'Connor team after Dom saved her life and offered her a place on their team. Giselle proved herself to be an integral member as her fighting and driving skills helped the team rob Hernan Reyes, Fast 5, and take down Owen Shaw, Fast and Furious 6. Sadly, Giselle's time was limited as it seemed that she was killed at the end of Furious 6 while saving Han. As the Fast and Furious franchise has often killed major characters off before, and the fact that Giselle didn't appear in Tokyo Drift, no one thought anything of it. However, as Fast X showed, this was a misdirection. Not only was she alive, but she was also working with Cypher to help her escape the Black Psych prison in Antarctica. Her reappearance may have surprised some, but if fans paid notice to Furious 7, they would have known she was potentially coming back based on one scene. Like the movies before it, the climax of Fast and Furious 6 was as exciting as ever as it was full of action and drama. Despite Giselle's apparent tragic demise, the Toretto O'Connor team managed to defeat Owen Shaw's crew as they successfully apprehended them while they were trying to escape. Owen Shaw appeared to have been killed off as well as the momentum of the plane caused him to be thrown out. However, it was soon revealed in Furious 7 that this was not the case as the opening scene showed him to be alive, albeit in critical condition. Considering that he fell from a greater height, compared to Giselle, the fact that he survived certainly created hope that maybe Giselle had too. In addition, the fact that the audience never saw Giselle's body after she fell from the plane wing also seemed to hint that the door was always left open for her. With Giselle confirmed to be alive in Fast X, the writers now have to fill in the gaps as to where Giselle has been, and how she even survived for the matter. While it's likely they will start from the point her body disappeared into the darkness, the audience would still need a proper explanation as to how she recovered from her injuries since they would have likely been life-threatening. Hopefully, the explanation will be a little less far-fetched than the one they gave Letty, and is a little bit more realistic than Hans was. But, nevertheless, fans are still excited to see where Fast and Furious 11's plot goes.